I would love to do a nice dramatic Airways going places video, but due to the current situation, and you know what I mean, um, abroad is shut. The Channel Islands don't want you, and so it's basically just local flights at the moment, I'm afraid. So a quick trip to Falmere near Duxford to meet up with some lads from Rochester for a lunch in a pub. Contact India, Roger, Squawk 7047, runway 21, line up away. 7047, line up 21, tango India. Contact India, runway 21, right turn out, 2010, quick take off. Let's take off, right turn out, tango India. Okay, you happy? Yep, all good. Again, it's full of executive jets as usual. Yeah. So at the end of the runway, we go 220 for one mile. Begin tower, good morning, it's Julia Tango, India 700. Control, airspace 1500 feet above. Tower, good morning. Good morning to you, sir. We are on a IFR flight plan to Lima, Echo Papa, Alpha, Palma de Mallorca today. Departure time is 11.30, uh, 1030, 10.30, and looking for the expected uh, departure, confirm Lloyd 2. AFM, you can expect the lid to departure. So we're looking for one mile DME before our right turn back yeah, to the uh, overhead. Two or 700, we will be requesting yeah. the of the wind. I'm on instruments uh, now, right turn back. Standard rate turn. Uh, Roger, at the moment, 720010, maximum 16. And uh, I'll uh, put that to 03 on the crest. I'll go up to 2000 if I can. Roger, I think. Good I'll get AZ, uh, 07 outside, Lidget 75 information, Golf 1012, requesting start for the Zeros. So 07 Alpha, start approved. Start approved, then start 07 Alpha. Tango India, what altitude are you climbing to? Uh, 2,000 feet, Tango India. Tango India, roger. Fear of Ocean's approach is active. Citation at 7 miles. Contact big and approach 129.405. 129.405 and copy that, Tango India. Controlled airspace 600 feet above. Big approach, Golf, Tango India, 1,900 feet. Oh, Tango India, report passing a beam to Swanley. Report passing a beam at Swanley, Tango India. Controlled airspace 500 feet above. We'll shortly be joining our course. So we'll put the GP the uh, autopilot on. Are you hooking to the GPS? Yeah, hands off no. and away she goes. Well done. I'm a pretty basic user, I, uh, I just use the yellow. Uh, oh, the heading. Heading bug, yeah. yeah. Press the nav button twice, it will follow your GPS course. Okay. Let's press it twice. Now zoom for the course in there in the first place. Yeah. Yes, I'm not suggesting you do, but if you, if you ever do fly basically to the dome over there, and then up through the Lee Valley, there is there's enough green space or water around to be legit, I think.
Cal Tango India, one lead, 2,000 feet. Thank you, Roger. You can support Cox Security now. Free for Farm Row 123 decimal 225 today. Farm Row 123 decimal 225 and Cox Security. Strangely, no other planes are out, or at least not many. Officially 4,000. I can see I've got one um, out on the Thames Estuary. Far east. Yep, sure, basically. Okay, good. Perfect. Oh, that's a good result. So what, what does the, the, the oh, arrow right. mean? That means he's descending. Oh, uh, okay. And he's plus one at nine, which means oh, he's, he's heading to the airport then, isn't he? Yeah, he's 1,900 feet higher than us. Higher than us, yeah. Okay. Take primary contact, showing that. Okay, right. Right. Now, 100 feet below us is a plane at nearby. Can you see that green circle? Yeah, yeah. Nearby, it means it's uh, just got an ordinary transponder. This machine can't tell exactly where it is, but it's around. Okay. And it's just, oh, it's just at the same level as us, actually. So at the same level as us, somewhere around here. Okay, is okay. Okay. Could be in the cloud, of course. Uh, one two zero decimal nine six five. Okay. Thanks. Probably just landing down there, I guess. Aircraft to head no, no, 11 o'clock, so 3 miles, 1,400 feet below, passing left to right. Okay, Aircraft to right, 2 o'clock, 3 miles, 1,600 feet above. Below. She's telling me. Uh, oh yes, okay, so just down there. Other aircraft. Right, so you've got a red circle. Green, uh, yellow now. Ah, oh, right, gone yellow, yeah. Going yellow is good. Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, no, no, I want to the last bound of this climbing, I would imagine. So the GPS is taking us on yeah. the course. So were you toggling between the GPS and the, the book? I did So do, you just go to the heading when you yeah. wanted to correct a little bit, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's useful to know. Well, nice being in the passenger seat. Yeah. You, see, you see a lot more, don't you? <laughs> do you know what? I enjoy being a passenger. I really do. Yeah. It's it's nice. You, yeah, you do see a lot more. Uh, yeah, he's climbing up to our flight path, isn't he? He'll be pretty much on the nose now. Yeah, there he is. Got him. Just crossing the motorway. To the right of the motorway. White, speck oh, yeah. on, green yeah. background. There yeah. he is, yeah. Absolutely. See, you know, isn't that good? Yeah, you can see exactly where he is, look. Yeah, yeah. So of course, the beauty now of the GPS with the autopilot is that having put the route in, even if it's a very complex route, yeah. it'll, it'll just It'll fly. do the turns, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, he's heading further west now. Yeah, he's, he's going to pass that. underneath those other way, yeah. Yeah, and my lady on the iPad is telling me that he's there. Yeah. I can see him, I don't know if you can. There's our plane again, straight ahead there. Well, he's climbed quite a bit, doesn't he? He's only 600 feet below now. Aircraft to head, 1 o'clock, 1.5 miles, 800 feet below, same heading. Yeah, it's interesting that uh, we can see that he's just down there. Yeah. And uh, this is showing beautifully on here. did that. He did it kind of an ass, didn't he? Warning. Well, Aircraft to the head. Yes, one o'clock. One mile. Eight hundred feet below. Same heading. Uh, Sandra, good morning. Ghost Charlie Lima, Mike India requesting traffic service. Uh, 
Charlie Lima, Mike, Indian Charlie Lima, Mike, India, Pacific Strip, 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 Charlie Lima, Mike, Charlie, Mike, India, Roger. Your radio is frequency 3, London QNH 1011. And that's why he's doing it. He's flying the approach to Stableford, yeah. Stableford, just a whole week, somewhere. I'll read you loud and clear. Goals Charlie Lima, Mike, India, with QNH 1011 and 5020. Got Mike, India, right, and basic service. Uh, basic service. And how do you read me now, sir? Uh, right about reasonably three to four with a background uh, interference. Understood, thank you. Got my kindy report your level. Uh, 1,600 feet QNH 1011 and I'll climb to 1,800 maintaining uh, VMT. Uh, Papa Lard, good morning, Golf Charlie Echo Yankee Hotel, request for service. What frequency are we on at Stelford? Uh, no, Zero we're on um, Barnborough East Radar. Oh, okay. Aircraft right 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 left, 10 o'clock, close. Got back in there. Understand you're at Pippistrow. Say again your departure point and destination. Uh, departure point so is Cayman Call, Echo Golf Mike Lima. And destination is Wickham Park, Echo Golf Tango Bravo. information from all around due to adjacent airspace and you're almost at the base of the we'll see how useful so traffic on your right hand side half a mile just departed north wheel indicating 800 feet southbound should pass behind understood radius traffic service and uh, looking out for traffic got back in the further traffic left 10 o'clock one mile that's parallel heading that's us yeah faster, indicating 1900 feet uh, visual with the traffic so goes back in there thank you Echo Yankee Hotel, Fomber Radar, pass message. Interesting to see if you can tell us about us. Yeah, that, that plane is coming parallel to us behind. Yeah, I thought he was sailing, right. he was heading to Stapleford. No, he's going to Wickham. Oh, is he? Oh, OK. So he was climbing to 1,800, didn't yeah, he? Yeah, so he's, he's coming up. I'm along. surprised if he can catch us. What are we doing? Uh, I'm well, I not. He's, in a, he's yeah. in a pit stall, isn't he? Uh, Right. Keep an eye on him. Only 300 feet below now. Yeah, we're losing that Pippis trail now. Yeah, I'm going to say that it's as fast as us. Oh, we're getting on very nicely. Yeah. We'll, uh, when we turn this corner, yeah. we'll have the wind behind us, and it's a 20, 20 knot wind, so. Is that right? I'm guessing the Rochester guys are behind us. Yeah. Given his tempers there, otherwise <laughs> there could be a lot of aircraft around very soon. Yeah. We better to have a bit more visual. It doesn't look too bad ahead there, does it? Uh. In the past, I've twice tried to fly to Dux for the first time. Oops, Not made it because of the weather. Would like to descent to I don't think it's particularly bad up here, usually. Just down back up again. Well, it's stand, the weather at Stansted is usually the worst around. Actually. Is it really? Yeah, the cloud-based cloud Stansted is always much lower than anywhere else. That's interesting. I, I'm yeah. very surprised at that. But yeah, no idea why, it just is. Because I always, I always think the weather coming in from the southwest. <laughs> hence, it kind of hits bigger than everything before it hits places like Stansted. Right, well, so we've got 18 miles to destination. Yeah. I've got the, um, you probably saw the joining instructions, which are quite specific, so I've got those oh, okay. in here as well. We join at uh, Royce, overhead Royston, to a right-hand circuit. 
uh, avoiding certain areas and so on. Yeah. I've got all that in here. So. Uh, and that's actually uh, You've flown here before, haven't you? Not to this one, no, actually. Have you not? Right, so I've now changed over to Duxford's frequency, which is what we have to do. And then I'll put Falmir. They may not answer Falmir, which will be fine. Okay, so we're now listening to Duxford information. Duxford ATZ, the classic. If any of our lads from Rochester are going in there now, we'll hear them. Yeah. So. Okay. Only nothing showing. Not much happening in Luton either. Yeah, well, there's not a great deal happens anyway. There's a couple going from Stansted. Go one near Duxford, probably just departing. Ah, yeah, there's one landing. Um, oh, yeah, there's one, one landing at Falmere. Yeah, it's okay. what, probably one of them. Yeah, yeah, it's quite low, isn't it? Yeah. Sending. Yeah, yeah. 26, thank you, Bravo, 24 left hand, QNH 1010. 20, Bravo, 24 left hand, 1010. I'll give them a shout, actually, at Duxford now. Along with 10 miles to the south. Duxford information. Good morning, Golf Mike Oscar, Tango India. Golf Mike Oscar, Tango India, Duxford information. Good morning, Tango message. Golf Mike Oscar, Tango India, Robin DR500 out of Biggin Hill inbound to Falmere uh, with the uh, Rochester group. Currently 10 miles to the southwest and uh, request airfield information, please. Thank you, India. Roman news that Duxford is 24 left hand pattern, Duxford QH 10110, QFE 1006. 1006 and 1010 the QNH. Uh, thank you for the information, Thank you, India. There was one aircraft in the Falmir circuit carrying out circuits at the moment. Duxford sent his active 24 left hand with one shortly to depart. Copy that, thank you, and we'll keep a look out, thank you, India. Tango wing 6, ready for departure. Tango wing 6, take off discretion 24 right, wind 22012, Falmir is active. Tango Martin, discretion 24 right, and copy, Falmir, Tango wing 6. Tango wing, report changing to Falmir radio. We'll go, Tango wing. Right, so the circuit height of Falmir is 1,000 feet on QNH. So we'll get down to that. We're approaching Royston up ahead, which is where we join the gang. Okay. Gulf Angwin, we are approaching Royston and descending to circuit height and changing to Falmere 135 decimal 705. What can you in your rush today? Good day, thanks to help. Golf, Mike, Oscar, Tango, India, inbound. Load. Full approach. Golf 2-5. Load and activate approach. Eight. There we go. The right hand circuit. Yeah. Good. We go overhead Royston, then we go off on 026 degrees. Hold on. Falmere, Golf Mike Oscar Tango India, overhead Royston, and uh, joining with right hand pattern 425. Following that railway. Well, aircraft's up to the right, I plan. Right. Like as above us. Keep an eye on him, he's slower than us as well. Okay, it's passing behind us. Falmer well, joining, we're joining right hand downwind at 425.
So I've got a visual approach going on. Okay. Which will give me a glide slope and a localizer. Be visual with the airfield. Um, I haven't actually seen it yet. If you, no, not either. Yes, there it is. There it is. There it is. There it is. Hangar, grass runway. Got it. Yeah. Right, so oh, we're yeah, yeah, there's the runway across there, isn't it? Yeah. We're downwind. See so yeah, how we're just going downwind, aren't we? Quite yeah. wide. <coughs> downwind right hand and the uh, wired pattern. Slightly unusual shape. And there's Duxford, of course, on the nose. Yeah. So brakes are off, under carriage down and locks, these are green, mags on both. Switches are on, harness seat and hatches. So we're supposed to go between these two satellites. Yeah, I would imagine so, yeah. Well, there are golf tank wind here, right mate. Wow, look how close Duxford is. Ah. Oh, wow. Oh, it's so close. Right, into the white arc. And up. Reds, blues, greens. On the runway. Oh, there's a tractor on the runway. Right. It's moving off, I think. Yeah. Turn around and come back. Very nicely done. Okay, and we'll just vacate here on the right. Okay, I'll do the taxi around. Hey, we've got some sunshine. Yeah, life is good. And the hatch bit. Yeah, just a touch. That's it. That's why taxiway as well, or did they use this as a room? Uh, this is a taxiway, I yeah, think. That's what I thought. Yeah. I'm sure it could be a runway. Yeah. For a micro light or something. Right, I wonder where we park. parking rules, yeah. Might ask. Gap between those, I <laughs> Looks like it's asking for somebody to park there, doesn't it? Can you get around the back of these? I don't know. Stick it in, I think. Yeah, I'd say so. These look like tie downs. Yeah, there's definitely one tie down under the wheel, so. That's the sort of place they expect you to park. There's another tie down there, so. Into wind? Yeah, so.
we go.